It's a problem for a, a racing point. Lance Stroll is being pushed out of the fast lane, is he? Yeah, it looks like it, doesn't he? He's being pushed out of the fast lane. Has Stroll got an issue? We're getting a replay of... Uh, everyone else is still well behind, mate. We've got loads of time now for this lap. Not a problem. You switch up. Oh, that was nice. <laughs> that was nice, says uh, Champierre, his uh, race engineer. He sort of undertook one of the Alpha Tauris. So Hamilton is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I think eighth in the queue behind the McLarens. Stroll's in big trouble. At the moment, he's in 12th, and uh, Racing Point are pushing him back to the garage. The session's just gone green, and Stroll needs a restart. So he's going to be going up. The session goes green, and the race begins and to already, get a flying lap in. Already, the Alpha Tauris are trying to give themselves a little bit of a gap on the way out of the pit lane, where you sort of can't overtake. This is going to be, and Verstappen sends it to the outside of Albon at turn one. So the Red Bulls are going to be fine. Oh, Hamilton's going to be so tight. I can't see it happening. He's got 20 seconds to spare going at a full speed lap. I think he's got no chance. The Alpha Tauris have just taken away 20 seconds for him. Hamilton's going to have to go. You're listening to need to muscle your way past these cars. The clock as he goes into turn two. I don't think he's going to do this. No. It surely can't be done. Right, a final sector is 27 seconds. So that'll be that'll be our sort of final checkpoint. Even the middle sector, which is just before 13, that is 33 seconds. So if there's a... No, he's got no chance. You need a minute left on the clock by the time you're in the middle sector, and he's nowhere near that. No, and he's backed off as well, coming out of the pit lane, I think. Hamilton is not going to be starting. Oh, and he's made a mistake at turn two. You need to muscle your way past these cars. He's going out. He's going out, Lewis Hamilton. He's gone across the uh, the runoff area at turn two, lost more ground to Ocon and Perez. And if it was already a, a need to muscle past the cars, he's got even more cars in front and he's more time behind. Well, oh, he's, he's just coming into the final sector now with about 26... He's got about 10 seconds to spare here, Hamilton. He's at the back of the queue. Everyone's going to start slowing down. This is going to be super tight. And even if he gets across the line, he's going to be in the middle of all the traffic. Ricardo, Bottas, Sainz, Perez, Norris, Gasly, Verstappen, Ocon, Leclerc, and Kvyat are the top 10 at the moment. 20 seconds left on the clock. Hamilton still has four corners to go if he wants to start his qualifying lap. He's now coming into the final two turns. It's going to be super tight. Eight seconds left. Five seconds left, he might just make it. He's coming through the final corner now. Three, two, one, and he gets across the line with a second to spare. Hamilton has made it. He is starting a final flying lap, but how are his tyres going to be? Sainz didn't make it and Perez didn't make it, so Hamilton had to make a couple of passes to get that lap in. Sainz and Perez were both passed, and uh, and they've not managed to get it through. Sainz, what can Hamilton do? Sainz should be able to make it through to the next part of qualifying, though. He's got only half a second away from Ricardo. He should be all right. Perez might be in trouble. Perez, they are third and fourth, so they've got a good chance. And now what condition are the tyres on anyone's car? How cold are they? Oh. How much traffic does everyone have? This is a crazy end to you too. What's Lewis Hamilton doing through the first sector? It's plenty fast enough. Well, it's the same as it's two tenths quicker than Gasly. It's a tenth quicker than Ocon, but you'd think that the tyres are just going to be coming more and more to him as the lap progresses. Albon four thousands up on Daniel Kvyat into the final sector. Albon needs to improve here to get himself into the top ten as well. Verstappen's going to be the first man across the line. He maybe needed to improve in a normal world because he was on medium tyres before. Now on the softs, he should. Oh, oh, no, he backs off. That's a bold move. So Verstappen bails out of it to try and start on the mediums. Here comes Albon sideways across the line to go seventh. Verstappen down to eighth. This, that's a brave one, isn't it? But Albon's just bumped his teammate down a place. Actually, no, he's... Ah! Where's he going to go? It's up into fourth position. Hamilton, by the skin of his teeth, makes it through. Leclerc out of qualifying in 11th. 12th for Kvyat. 13th Lance Stroll. 14th George Russell. 15th Sebastian Vettel. Good, quick thinking by Red Bull, meaning Max Verstappen and Valtteri Bottas are the two drivers that will start on the medium tyre tomorrow. One second Hamilton started that flying lap by. That was so fine. Ah! So Leclerc must have made a mistake then because